We've been building pressure washers for a while now, and now we are taking on a new challenge. It's not the most lucrative segment, but incredibly relevant to those who trust Active to wash their cars. I'm Jude from Active, filling in for James and JC while they are out traveling the world. In this series, you'll be joining me, James and JC once they're back, as we take you behind the scenes from concept to market for the new Active Blower design. This is the Active Blower design and development series. The car dryer segment isn't exactly refined. Let me explain. There are two clear camps of products for car dryers. You have the corded solutions and the cordless solutions, and a rising third segment that has gone viral on TikTok, which are the small digital motor blowers. Corded units like the Metrovac over here and big boys dominate one side, whereas cordless tools like Ego sit on the other. But none of them are truly built for car drying. They are adapted from pet or yard tools. So can't this be used on cars? Sure, but does that mean there is no room for a car drive made by an automotive brand? What does automotive focus even mean? In this series, we explore those questions. Will we end up building one? Who knows? But the journey will be fun. And maybe, just maybe, we create something you truly need. Let's take a step back. Why even build a blower? We look at what's out there, and here's what we found. When it comes to cordless, the pros are pretty clear. It's great for drying one to two cars, it's affordable if you have an existing battery platform and the CFM cannot be matched, especially when it comes to the Ego. But the cons, it's pretty loud. It's hard on your hands as you need to carry it all around. It's weak in crevices, doesn't really blow the water out and there is no heated or filtered air. When it comes to the corded, the pros is there is no downtime. You can keep going. It's pretty good for a professional setup. There is high wind speed for nooks and crevices and there's less fatigue on your hands as you only need to carry the hose and the nozzle. But the cons are that it takes quite a bit of cord and hose management and it's still pretty noisy. The active blower will be corded. Why? We don't have a battery platform to uh, leverage a blower from. But we'll make it super cool. We've been quietly building one for over a year now and it's time to share it with you. When it came to the ideation stage of the active blower, it needed to hit two clear goals. How can we be the quietest blower in the market? and how can we deliver 20 amp like performance in a household circuit. Like the 2.0 and 2.3, it must carry our DNA, performance, style and function in perfect sync. This isn't just our journey, it's yours too. So here's your assignment. Tell us, what do you hate about current car dryers or blowers? Are they even relevant today? Should Active even build one? Drop your thoughts on the comments, we are reading everyone. In the next video, we test our first prototype with you. See you then.